Welcome back to Bowser's Castle, everybody! So we've gotten through probably the first third, maybe a little bit more of the castle. I feel like the first area is longer than the other areas, especially if you've got spin attack and can insta-KO the enemies. Hi, Magic Koopa! Uh-oh, that's not good. Whew, no, that's not good at all. Hey, this looks like a good opportunity to show Ah, uh, Actually, I'll show off Mega Shock. Press A and B together repeatedly. I'm not good at that. Okay, so the Koopa Trolls are out for longer than the Magic Koopas. And Cooper can just power shell him. Thank you, Cooper. Who needs his star points anyway? Aw, oh, man. Spin attack's not working out in my favor. Oh, boy! Told you these guys would show up again. This is a bony beetle. They're bony, uh, buzzy beetles, hence the name. Max HP 8, attack power 3, defense power 4. It's tough to damage them. When their spikes are out, their attack power is 5. When they retract their spikes, take the opportunity to flip them over. After that, beating them will be a breeze. Or, you know, Mega Quake. Actually, they've got 8 HP, so that won't quite kill them. Plus one defense. Aw, oh, heck no. You did not just do that. Take that, you uh, you guys. <laughs> you bozos. You're not gonna beat Mario. Especially when he has four fanes of repel gel at his disposal. Yo. Oh, that's right, it's this room. It's the sushi room. It's pretty cool. So there's a locked door. If Bombette were about three times bigger, we could just blow all these walls up. It would certainly let us move through these areas a lot faster, but that's probably not a good idea. It would be far too dangerous. Yeah, it's like Minecraft. You can blow a hole and then ball of the sun. Boom! Lava at the other end. Now we're gonna flood the room. Poor Goombario. He was still down there. <laughs> Alright, Sushi. Let's go. Now, I like how the doorways are so huge in this area. So we can still swim through them. Castle key, we gotta get that. Here, Bombette. I feel like there's an invisible block in this area somewhere. Maybe not. There it is. I knew there was an invisible block in this room somewhere. Oh, this means I'll have to drop something. Never mind, I'm not getting maple syrup. Also, I love the sound effect here. This whole area is just awesome. Pulling the chains. It's a lot of fun. And it's good to use Sushi again. Sushi does, is probably one of the partners that gets used the least, along with Whack a Lester. And alright. Castle Key. Looks like we're gonna have to drain the water again. <laughs> G 
just keeps getting invisible. I don't like the backtracking element of this room, but everything else is pretty awesome. Hi-ho, sushi away! Still think it's a cruel name to give a fish, but whatever. Alright, now we can go from here. I totally forgot about this part. I completely forgot about these enemies. Bullet bills are back, except this time they're bombshell bills. This is a bombshell bill. Bombshell bills have such beautiful gold casings. Of course, if you sit in a them, you'll get hit. Max HP free, attack power six, defense power zero. Pay attention to their HP because their explosions get bigger as their HP drops. Really? Didn't know that. Let's take them out before they get near us. Phew. Well, if we just spin into them. This is a Bombshell Bill Blaster. Bombshell Bill Blasters shoot a constant stream of Bombshell Bills. Max HP 10, Defense Power 4. They won't attack you directly. They're pretty resilient. You have to keep attacking them, though, otherwise the air will be filled with Bombshell Bills. And nobody wants that. Too true. Well, Mega Quake will do a good job. Huh. You know what? Let's try Lacko Esther's ability that we haven't used yet. Hurricane. Press A and B together repeatedly. This again. Well, all blew away the Bill Blasters, so that's cool. <laughs> you don't get star points for that, but since I don't get star points for them anyways, I thought we should try it. Nice going, Lacko Esther. And geez, we're running low on FP. I've been just eating through that. That'll make the optional boss a bit more interesting. Maybe I should equip Heart Finder. Or, I'm sorry, Flower Finder. Whoop! Darn it. Forget this. Small target. But Lackluster is a sharp shot. Yeah, we can't even do Mega Quake now. What is the world coming to? Wait, we should be able to do Mega Quake. Take 7 FP. Okay, at least we've got some uh, jelly uh, items. Take that bombshell, Bill Blasters. In your face! That's the power of max level Mario. Oh boy! I forgot this was in this part. Yep, I think this is like one of the last enemies in the game we have to tattle on. This is the Dry Bones. Dry Bones are skeletal remains of Koopa Troopas. Max HP 8, attack power 4, defense power 2. Just when you think they're beat, these guys rise back up and attack again. You're gonna have to beat them all at once. Or you could use fire attacks. If they become ashes, there's no way they'll recover. Oh. Fire shell will be a good idea, then. Ow. Alright. It's time for Watt to come into her own, then.
Yeah, they'll stay bones for a couple of turns, but then they'll come back to life with full HP. So you want to beat them before that happens. Dry bones are so annoying. Especially in Mario Kart. Also, some of these Bowser statues you can move. Whoop. Can't you spin attack against them? Really? Up and away! need a super shroom. Alright, yeah, we can move this one. Also, we can find some ultra shrooms in this area. Ooh, yes, please. I needed that. Alright, so we got a locked door. Hi. Hi. No thanks. I don't know why my spin attack didn't work against the dry bones. Maybe he hit me with his bow? I don't know. Take that hammer, bro. Okay, so we've got an already open corridor. Empty room, huh? So clever little puzzle here, what you have to do is actually push this over that door, and a new opening comes up. I think that's very clever, personally. And that gives us the castle key. I swear there's an ultra shroom in here, though. I know there are like one or two Ultra Shrooms you get in Bowser's Castle, if you're good. Hi. Take that. Oh boy. I believe this leads to... ...certain doom. Yep! It's this guy again. Bro, who would have thought you could make it this far? You won't make it any farther because, unfortunately for you, I won't let you pass. <laughs> but, I guess if you really want, I'll give you one chance. Because I know there's no way you'll make it anyways. Want to give it a shot? Well, I mean, sure. <laughs> this is completely pointless, but I suppose I'll let you try. Because, of course, I have such a kind and generous heart. Just joking, worm. <laughs> Now, Mario, do you want to know what I've got in store for you? Heck yeah. Now for a little quiz. Several of my followers will come out here. Your job is to carefully keep track of their numbers and colors. Then you'll have to answer my questions correctly. Quite frankly, we both know that this is impossible, but if you get five questions right, I'll let you go through here. You're allowed only two mistakes, though. Grrrhaha! <laughs> Fool that you are. You'll likely make three mistakes and suffer the dire consequences. Let's get going. So we've got three Dark Troop, three Dark Koopas, and four Goombas. So the way this works, if you get free roll, it's not instant death, but rather, time's up. Rather, you fight the optional mini boss that I want to fight. Now, tell me, how many Koopas were there? There were three. So I'm gonna get a few right, just because I want to sh show off all of the different patterns you can get. Grr, you're right. That question must have been way too easy. Now they'll be harder. Next question. Well, three green shy guys, four green shy guys, four blue shy guys, three red shy guys. Time's up. Now, which were the three of? Uh, there were three reds. Grr, you're right. That question must have been way too easy. Now they'll be harder. Next question. Two red, 
four blue, two green. Time's up! Now, who came out of the middle entrance? Uh, Red Shy Guys did. Grr, you're right! That question must have been way too easy. Now they'll be harder. <laughs> Next question. Two Goombas, four Koopa Troopas, three Blue Shy Guys, one Green Shy Guy. Time's up! Now, how many Goombas were there? There were two. Now I'm gonna start getting them wrong. Grr, right answer! Ah, I can't believe you've gotten four questions right! Alright, enough of this. I'm gonna quit messing around and ask you a really hard one. Next question. <laughs> okay, one Goomba, one Koopa, one Dark Koopa. Nobody came out of the left side. Now, how many arms did you see just then? There were six. No, Goombas don't have arms. <laughs> Biz Rom, what an idiot! Durr. You'll be hating life if you make free mistakes, Mario. <laughs> Let's get to the next question, shall we? Well, two red shy guys, three green bob bombs, one green shy guy, and then four Koopa Troopas. Time's up! Now, which were they free of? Uh. I actually don't remember. Koopa Troopas? I think there were four of them. Good. Bzz, pinhead! Wrong again, worm! Something horrible will happen if you make one more mistake. Just one more Mario, you're hanging by a Fred. Just trust me when I say this optional mini boss if you get free wrong. If you're not prepared, you're gonna die so fast. <laughs> now, the next question. Two dark Koopas, two blue Shy Guys, two blue, uh, red Shy Guys, and then three Goombas. Time's up! Three Koopas, three Goombas, and then two of each Shy Guy. Now, you just saw some Koopas. I ask you this, what color were their shells? They were green! <laughs> Buzz! <laughs> ah! No, that's wrong, idiot! You made three mistakes! Too bad for you, Mario! As promised, here's your horrible reward! Prepare for battle! Anti-Guys Unit! Attack! I'll let you go through if you manage to beat them, but that's impossible. I guess you might as well try. <laughs> oh no! I didn't do my badges yet! Oh, well, okay then. Yeah, you get to fight three anti-Guys. Okay, well to start, we're gonna put on some Repel Gel. <laughs> I've titled on anti-guys before, though. This is an anti-guy. His attacks are so intense, he's also called Deadly Guy. Max HP 50, attack power 10, defense power 0. His attack power is 12 when he does an acrobatic attack, so dodge it. This guy is for real, so we better take him seriously. I titled on him before. Yeah! Three anti-guys! This is where Repel Gel is really helpful. Okay, time for Mega Quake. You want to attack all of them at once, if at all possible. Woohoo! I've never attempted to beat these guys. I can't remember how long Repel Gel lasts. But yeah, if they all decide to do their acrobatic technique, you're going to take 36 damage if you don't defend. So, yep, they're tough. Okay, Repel Joe doesn't last too long, does it? Alright, what I'm going to do is I'm going to try out Dizzy Shell then. Never done it before. Tap A repeatedly, alright. Okay, well two of them are Dizzy.
Nine damage is still not nice. This is also why I have life shrooms. Okay, I'm definitely not going to need all the repel gel. No way. How about a bit of fire, Scarecrow? Hot, hot, hot. Ooh, man. Alright. Time for some more Repel Gel. Not a lot of people know about this mini-boss. But Dane, let me tell you, it is hard if you don't have Repel Gel. In your face! In your face! In your face! So I'm thinking... <laughs> I'm gonna use Refresh! <laughs> I just want the plus 5 FP, basically. <laughs> so that way I can use Mega... or Power Bomb, and then I can kill them all with a single attack. And if I wanted to, I could have no damaged the anti-trio. Die, anti-trio. <laughs> and also, if you equip a bunch of power pluses and the P up D down badge, you can damage a fifth of their HP with a single mega quick. Oh, but no, no! You beat the anti guys unit. My last line of defense, the mighty anti-guys didn't stand up to Mario! Grow! I can see defeat. I've been defeated by Mario. Why? 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 <laughs> I must admit, he probably was not expecting that. Oh boy. Super Shroom. Let's eat it. Ooh, maple syrup. Let's drink it. And I like Bowser's balcony. Ooh, Super Shroom. Eh, we don't have to eat it right now. Man, another Super Shroom. Ooh, and a Jam and Jelly up there. Sweet. Literally. Guess I might as well eat a Super Shroom. I love the peaceful music up here. It's less chaotic than the ones inside the castle. Alright, I swear I've missed an altar shroom somewhere. Maybe not. Oh yeah, now the music's really awesome. We must save the toads! Prison key, everybody out! I'm here to save ya! Oh Mario, thank you for coming! It's so good to see you! All the prisoners got split up, so it's been just us four. Are the others all safe? Please don't say we're the only ones you've saved. I hope this whole horrible mess will be over soon, so we can have a reunion with everybody. If I'd known this was going to happen, I would have gone home with Mayor Penguin. I wish I'd wake up in Shiver City and never have to leave again. <laughs> I dream of sweet shaved ice treats every single day. Oh, poor guy. Mario, good work finding us. Thanks for coming. I can't believe I was captured so easily. How shameful. I bet Princess Peach is being held under heavy security. Please, save her. This is a makeshift toad house. The toad house's slogan is refresh your body and soul. I know it's not a great house, but plenty of sea bleep will hear you no matter where you happen to be sleeping. Will you take a nap? Yes, I will. I need a bunch of FP restored. And some star power. Did you sleep well? Then take care and go. Good luck, Mario. Bowser's no match for you. Well, thank you. That's too kind. I just realized there are so many items that I made that I never even used. 
feel kind of bad about it. Because there are really only two fights left that I have to do. Or I guess three. Oh boy. Oh, that's right. This is where the Ultra Shroom is. Alright, stupid Dry Bones. I will spin attack you. You can't spin attack Dry Bones. What the heck? Up and away, I guess. This is what happens when you turn into a star. Alright. I was expecting another shop. So what we want to do is... You go, Bombette. Thank you. Now we get an Ultra Shroom, and we do not need a Super Shroom. I better get another shop, because there are some items I want. Take that. Okay, then. Don't know why spin attack is not working all of the time. I also still need to show off airlift, don't I? Hey, Cooper. Thanks, Cooper. And we get a castle key. Wow. Mario's like, I have to finish spinning before I show off the castle key. Thanks, Hammer Bro. I'm trying to think, I believe airlift's the only one that I... and only move I need to show up. Oh, and water block! Okay, so alright, memorize the pattern of these torches. Up, down, down, up, down, up. So... Up. Down. Down. Then up, down, up. Don't know how Bowser makes infinite mazes, but all right. I think a spike shield got turned off. No, it didn't. Cool. Got to carry somebody off. I'm going to use airlift on Magikoopa. Tap it repeatedly. Get out of here. <laughs> Later, dude. I believe that's the only move that I had to show off, though. Because Oh, and Water Block. Need to do Water Block. But other than that, I believe that was everything. I even did Turbo Charge on the General Guy battle. And I did Spook as well. Yeah. That was the last one. Take that. I love this ominous music, ominous music. I believe we've got another mini boss coming up. Oh, ow, please don't, how could you? What? <laughs> I totally forgot about this part. 
Oh, Mario! You came to rescue me! Thank you so much! Oh, me? Oh, I just saw a chance to get away from Bowser and I ran! There's no need to fight him because I'm already safe. See? No need to fight! Let's hurry up and go home. I'll be right behind you. It looks like Princess Peach, but something just doesn't seem right. I mean, I've never met the princess, but I thought she was more... sweet. Hey, Mario! Is she really Princess Peach? Oh, ow! Please don't! How could you? Oh, ow! Please don't! How could you? Alright, follow me, princess. Uh, Peach? Uh-huh, I thought so! I totally forgot about this part. This is a really cool throwback to Shiver City. Oh, what? What's wrong, Mario? A suspicious guy? I... I didn't see anything. Maybe it was your imagination. Huh? You what? You want to save the people in Peach's castle? Who cares about them? <laughs> yeah, this is not Peach. Now there's no time to spare. Let's get out of here. Ouch! Oh, how could you? You're so cruel, Mario. Why do you want to hurt me? I'm going to tell King Bowser you're treating me like this. No! Ow! Stop it! Please don't! Help me, King Bowser! I said cut it out! <laughs> ah, shoot! I wonder how you saw for my disguise. It was perfect! Well, I guess there's nothing I can do about it now. I'll just beat you up instead. Yeah, sure you will. Ooh, four of you guys. Eh, uh, heck no. Up and away. We're going to use up, up and away. I really need to get to the store. I think there's two of them. I hope there's two of them. Because I want my deluxe feast. Later. Nope. Blah, how in the world did you get this far in the castle? Congratulations. But this is the end of your adventure, I'm afraid. I've got much better defenses than the other guard doors do. Your luck has just run out. Come on, boys! YES! Here come the Koopa Bros! I bet you never thought you'd see us again, huh, Mario? You do remember who we are, don't you? How could I forget? Yeah, that's right! We were too cool to forget! A lasting impression, yeah! Now they're going to beat you within an inch of your life! Feel like running away, worm? To tell you what, if you beat them, you can go through here. Of course, you'll fail. But at least you can try. <laughs> Don't think we're like we were before, Mario. We've increased our power beyond our wildest dreams. After you trounced us, we learned a new technique and trained all day, every day. We're not just the Koopa Bros. We're the super ultra mighty Koopa Bros the Great. Check out our coolness. Huh? Wah! I found you, Mario! At last, you're mine! It was a pain finding you, you know. Today, at long last, I'll settle my score with you. I would rather fight the Koopa Bros, but alright. Here it comes, Mario! This is the final fight! Only one of us is walking away from this battle. And it's gonna be me. <laughs> I love how they brought back the Koopa Bros just for this. I would much rather fight them again, though. Than Ch Ch Junior Troopa. It's Junior Troopa again! My man! This little guy still has some eggshell left on his body. Aw! Max HP 60, attack power 8, defense power 2. I thought he had 80 HP here. Whoa, he's been working out. He looks as though he's been able to change his shape, too. You've got to love this guy's effort, Mario, to follow us all the way here. What dedication! Come to think of it, how do you get, think he got here anyways? Well, I mean, he can fly. Aw, oh, man. Now I'm gonna have to trek all the way back to the store just to get the things I want. What's well, gonna be best? Darn it! Okay, try this on for size. Ultimate power! You got this part again? This is why you want Spike Shield. Why is the music kind of lagging? Come on, Junior Troopa. 
Why'd you have to ruin the Koopa Bros fight, huh? Shoot! Okay, maybe something else. How about this? I totally forgot he could refill his own HP. Not that it'll do anything. I just love Watt for all these boss battles. He's gonna have one health left. Arg! You've still got some skills! Yeah, I do. Tell you what, Goombario, you can finish him. Goodbye, Junior Troopa. Darn it! Darn it! Darn it! Don't think you've won, Mario! I swear to you, I'm gonna beat you so bad next time! Gosh! Um. So, since you beat the guy that beat the Koopa Bros, does that mean you beat the Koopa Bros? No, you beat him, he beat them. But you didn't actually lay a finger on... Dog! It's too confusing! Okay, fine. I guess there was no big difference between that guy and the Koopa Bros. You could go through. It's not possible for you to beat King Bowser anyway. I'll let you have the honor of being beaten personally by the evil King Bowser. Lucky you! Alright, but before we do that, I need to go back to that shop. Seriously, like, I... I swear there was two shops here. I would have sworn it. Well, that was a long trek, but all right. Hey, dude. I'm here to claim some stuff. I'm carrying too much. Oh, yeah. Let's see. Honestly, the Ultra Shroom and the Jam and Jelly are pretty boring, to be perfectly honest. And one of my life shrooms. I almost don't want to use my repel gel as well. Alright, let's see. Deluxe feast for sure. And pebble. Why not? Ooh, and the fire pop. Yes. Is that really it? Alright, I'm not going to take my repel gel, to be perfectly honest. Because I honestly didn't expect to get two of them. Is there anything else that I could get? Strange cake, I guess. Oh, the sweet shroom. Oh, that's a good one. Yeah, sweet shroom. And I'll keep an empty slot because there's actually the life shroom that we can get in Bowser's uh, Prince Peach's Castle. All right, let's trek all the way back. All right, we're finally, finally back. This is the last room in Bowser's Castle. We're going up, 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 and then. We're at Peach's Castle. Actually, if memory serves. Sure enough. Ultra Shroom! Cool. That's where we're leaving the episode there. Thanks for watching, I'm Colorful Hardy. Next episode will be the last one. We're going to finally beat Paper Mario, and kind of sad to see the series go. And in another way, I'm relieved, because I can finally take a break from Let's Playing until 2017. Thanks for watching. Have a great day, and God bless.